<laughs> is this live? Yo, and welcome back to another episode of The Honest Take. Today we're going to be reacting to Too Much Heaven by the Bee Gees. Now, I don't know any of the discography of Bee Gees except for, you know, Staying Alive. So I, I have no idea what to expect with this. I know the guy's got an amazing voice. But uh, yeah, guys, as always, please like, share, and subscribe to the channel, and we're going to jump right into this. Here we go. Oh, that's something in the 1970s they always did with the snare. You see how it's pivoted towards his legs? And that's because... Um, Drummers were coming off of something called traditional grip, and that's where you hold the stick more like this. And in the late 80s, it flipped over to like this. And that's when the snare drum flattened out. Because in war times, they had to sling the drum over your side like this, and it would make sense to pivot like that so you don't have to go like this. You could still have your elbow down and be comfortable. Anyway, that's just my inner drummer talking. <laughs> Is this live? Oh my God. The, I didn't realize the BG sound was three people mixed together. Holy cow, that voice is perfect. You would think those are the same people. Wow. Wow, are they brothers? Wow. Even the the intonation and the the accents, it's perfect. I'm just, I'm having a hard time even believing that that voice is real. But what year is this? This is like 1979, I think it said. No processing, probably one take. <laughs> wow. To fade away. Oh, Gosh, that, I forget the word for it, but I'm going to say tremolo. Call me out if it's wrong. But that tremolo in his voice for how softly he's singing, because that gain, the, the gain on that microphone is, it's super hot. I mean, they're singing super soft, but to get like that airy floaty tone, it's unreal. And like they're moving back and forward like that on the mic. It's wild. Got a highway to the sky. We can turn away from the night of day and the tears we had to cry.
Like, I know he's amazing, but can we well, credit where credit's due? These backup singers are singing flawlessly. I mean, they might not have the power of the lead singer, but I mean, they sound so good. You, you would have thought it was a keyboard, like the chorus effect. I wouldn't be surprised if the chorus effect was modeled after these people. You know, it's so perfect. Guys, that was unbelievable. I mean, I know the BGs were incredibly talented, but to see it like acted out in video format and seeing them sing with such ease and it was really something. Wow. I had no idea this song existed, but I'm glad I do now. Guys, if you like the reaction, please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, if you like me, I love you. And if you don't, you can fuck off. Peace.